Hey guys, it's Factory 5000 here. We're at the lobster hatchery today. And in this tank we have um, Captain Barnacles. Look how big he is. It's back and attacking your appetite with colossal flavor from the deep. Flavor of awesome proportions. In there, there's a nice blue one. It's really nice. Look, in there, there's some lobsters that have babies under their tails. See those black things? They're eggs. Hey! Good. Over there, here, there's some baby lobsters that you can look at. They're really cute. Look at them. Look at them. And here, we've got lobsters that have just been born. Oh. <laughs> They're like tiny pieces of krill flying around. I am back. Say hello to the audience. Say hello. <laughs> hello. So yeah, I'm back and we're now going to be a marine. mini burina bye bye bye. How are you saying? How are you saying? Jellyfish, anglerfish, and a sea urchin that can live for 200 years. Fishing! Let's just go a little fishing! Let's go fishing! Oh, hello, fish! Have a best crab! Well, that's, that's what it's made out of. That's kind of cool. That's made of that. And what's this made out of? Have a look. Whoa! Guys, we're going to go and see Sid and go behind backstage. That's him over there. Here he comes, he's coming in. There, no, that's more one there. There she is, Sydney! <laughs> Sydney! <Yay>, Sydney! Is that good? We get to have a, we get to see a lobster that has been. Come on, it's hold It's got you. Bye bye. Say thank you very much. Thank you. Guys, we're gonna do a surprise. Okay? Mm. You might have not seen anyone else do this on any other channel. They're just getting in their car. And we are going to release those lobsters. There's tons of steps and also at the end I'll pretty much put this underwater so you can see them go free. <laughs> and we're going. Yay! Woo, let's go, go, go! We're here. And they're over there getting ready. And, and I think I'll ask them to tell you the steps, and then at the end we can watch it. Go to freedom! We're here starting to release it. We need to find a massive rock pool near the. See, we have to do something lots of climbing. <laughs> I don't even know what this beach is called. Come on, Freddy. We've now decided where we're going to put them. So are you going to read something? Where are you going? Where are you going, Hot? So we need to wait for a while. Let's make sure Freddy doesn't eat them live. <laughs> <laughs> Do not eat the lobsters, Freddy. Good afternoon, guys. We are down on the beach here in North Cornwall. We've got a few of our juvenile lobsters that are big enough now, ready to release. So we've got a few of them down to the awesome low tide rock pools down here on the north coast of Cornwall. Um, so we've got volunteers down here. Um, 
Rachel here is going to help release the lobsters today and also technician Jackie is on hand as well to lend a hand. Um, so we've got around about 50 lobsters, um, they're in the, this tray at the moment and in a minute the guys will get them out to show you what they look like before they're released. So these guys are around about two months old, as you can see, they're very little at this stage. Just about an inch to two inches long. So these lobsters have come straight from the hatchery today and they'll be around about, they'll have spent those two months in the hatchery and they would have molted five times to get to this size. So they're big enough now, although they're only two inches long, they're big enough to find their way down to the bottom of the seafloor. Um, and they'll hide away in the seaweed and under rocks in holes in the reef. So at this stage they're much less likely to be eaten than when they first hatch out um, because for the first two weeks of their lives they live in the plankton, so they float in the water column. So we're down here, we found a nice rock pool with some really good kind of seaweed cover and lots of rocks that they can hide in and amongst. And we're right down on the bottom of the tide near, near where the sea is, it's going to come in as the tide turns soon. So these guys will be able to make their way out and find um, other areas of habitat close by but not miles away um, on this stretch of North Cornwall coast. So I think we're ready to start releasing the animals. So what these guys here will do is they'll just start to tilt the tray a little bit and you should see some of the lobsters start to swim away to freedom. So they fled. Little bit of seaweed there. Each one. So the tide will sort of come back and cover them back over. And they'll be able to start. <laughs> yeah, he's got a nice head. <laughs> Daddy! Daddy! See? Do you like his hairdo? <laughs> Hello, Mr. Quack. Do you want to find a place to pop him back in? Daddy's got a hairdo. Yeah, he's over there. Dad! He's got a hairdo. We have just found a starfish! <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 